Don't forget to check out and grab your copy of our two newly released books, Football, A Love Story, and What Did Football Teach Me? These books feature over 100 stories from current and former coaches, players, executives, and entertainers from across the football landscape describing what got them involved in a game, what they love about it, and what life lessons the game taught them. You can find your copy or order your copy from our website at footballgameplan.com slash books. Welcome to footballgameplan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook here with Temple's defensive lineman, not just defensive tackle, Matt Ioannidis. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Here's the thing. I say defensive lineman because I've watched about five of your games live and the rest on film. I think you could play anywhere up front. I appreciate that. I really do. And that's something that I think is important is to be versatile and be able to play anywhere. So I appreciate you saying that. Well, here's the thing. If people think you only can do one thing on a football field. They think, okay, well, he's only a five-tech, right. only a one-tech. Is there really that much of a difference playing up front? No, I mean, if you can, pretty much if you can play one spot, you can play most of them, especially on the, when it comes to different situations down and distance-wise. But with our scheme we played in, uh, in, in college under Phil Snow, we've, we've – We've played it all, so everyone feels pretty comfortable playing certain spots. I mean, if you're 320 pounds, you're probably not going to play end, but <laughs> you know, some of the other guys can play a lot of spots. Now, when you look at your overall Owls career, what would you say was the one shining moment from that entire four-year career? Uh, honestly, just because of the way the season wrapped out, uh, winning the divisional championship, that's something, you know, unfortunately we didn't win the conference championship against Houston, but just to see a... a Four and seven, two and ten, six and six program turn around to ten and two to finish the regular season, and just a three-year span under Coach Rule is just incredible, and I can't be more appreciative of that. Now, one thing when I talk to a lot of different high school players, they tend to focus on one aspect of the position they play. Let's say I play running back, so a lot of people okay. will say, "Okay, I just want to run outside," but really, there's a lot of nuance. So yeah. for you, people think sacks, but there's a lot of technique involved. Absolutely. Uh, what's the one element you want to get out there to high school kids that, hey, you have to really be proficient in this if you want to get to this point at the Senior Bowl? You know, something that my coaches always said at Temple was uh, stop the run on the way to the pass. So, I mean, you definitely got to stop the run. I mean, it's going to be hard to get on the field if all you can do is pass trust. I mean, being a third down guy is great, but you're missing most of the game. So definitely put an emphasis on stopping the run. Now, and this is a philosophical question, okay. final question. No, that's fine. All right, you, you ready for this one? Yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is a little deep Hit now. Me. Let's me. say you go back to your freshman, your senior year, right, which is now. Yes, sir. If you want to go back and talk to freshman Matt Ioannidis, what would you tell him? Uh, fundamentals. It's something I didn't harp on quite enough when I was younger. And, you know, looking back to it, coming into college is such a big transition and playing defensive line in the trenches anywhere really specifically you gotta you gotta develop fast mature fast and if i could just tell myself harp on the fundamentals from a young age strike with you learn to strike with your hands and not just run down the middle of people it's it's that's really crucial to all developing underclassmen well i think you've done a great job out your career you listen to yourself then <laughs> you know now but wish you the best of luck moving Thank you forward very much. i appreciate that